today I'm gonna show you guys how I get um, my husband's medication ready this is how everything is lined up so I have the swab this is the alcohol swab and then this is the fluid to flush and then I wipe it again and then this is the medication the antibiotics medication so I kind of get everything ready like this and then we have a swab again and then I flush again you want to flush the pick line and then you do the aqua swab and then this is the um, ep epirin lock flush like uh, for the blood thinner and then this is the cap that goes over the peak line so this we repeat this part I repeat twice a day this part um, once a day so we're gonna start get started now so this is as you can see this is the peak line and the peak line goes into his hand and it goes all the way there so what I'm gonna do is you have to make sure your hands are washed make sure you wash your hands you can wear a glove but my hands are washed and I'm more comfortable like this so you can re remove the cap once you remove the cap you take the alcohol wipe you're gonna open it up and you're gonna wipe this for 30 seconds 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 20, 29, 30. So once that is clean, you're going to take the um, IV flush. This is the flush. is the sodium chloride injection to flush the line. So when you do this, you put it through here. And then you turn it to lock it. Don't lock it too tight. Just lock it well enough. Now you see a bubble over here. You want the bubble to be up at the 10 right there. So I'm going to hold it down like this. And then you're going to go very slowly every two digits. So you can see me doing it slowly. Slowly. When you get to two digits, I'm at the 8 right now. I'm going to wait for a second. And I'm going to go slowly again. I'm going to get to the 6 and wait and then I'm going to go slowly get to the 4 and wait and then do it again once I get to the 2 you notice that the bubble is right at the 1 you don't want to push that bubble into that is very bad so we're done you're going to unravel like this get another wipe if you notice I'm not touching the tip and then you're gonna wipe 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 so you're done with that now this is the medication and what you're gonna do is that you're gonna put the medication down like that you're gonna get the beginning part of the medication you're gonna unravel this uncap it screw it in here like this once you've screwed it in set this down and then this is where the starter is so this is what turns it on and makes the medication flow through you're gonna turn it on once you open it up you see the medication is flowing in so you can see the medication flowing in right there so the key thing is this medication the bubble is gonna shrink you have to press it down usually it takes about 45 minutes when you press it this place should be hard as soon as the middle part is hard and solid it has finished draining the medication the key thing is because you have several you do this like every eight hours so you have to set out the next batch after you finish doing this because you don't want this to be cold you don't want the medications to be cold because if it's cold while you're shooting it through the body it's gonna be very cold inside the body that is a no-no set it out before you 
do the next round so about eight hours so right now I'm done with this and I just have to wait for it to deflate which is about 45 minutes or so and we'll come back after this has been deflated so it has been about 45 minutes so what you do is you see it has been deflated so what you do is you press this and if it's solid hard that means that the medication has finished um, doing its job like going through the pick line so now the next thing you do is you want to close this up so you want to close it by pressing it down like that once you've closed it the next thing that you do is you come over here and you unravel like untwist it and this is done you can discard it so now we want to take the um, alcohol wipe and I'm just gonna wipe it again 30 times 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 20 29 30 once I've done that the next thing I'm gonna flush again so you want to do another flush so open this up and put that in there connect it in turn it and we're gonna flush it so the bubble is up here you want the bubble to be down here so the bubble should be at the 10 once the bubble is at the 10 right there you go slowly every two digits so from 10 to 8 once you get to 8 wait one second and go slowly again 8 to 6 wait one second six to four wait one second four to two you notice that the bubble now is sitting at one you stop and you unravel again then you want to wipe with another alcohol wipe again tear that in the middle move the alcohol wipe like that and wipe again 30 times 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Now it's time for the apron. So I'm going to unlock this. Put that in. Now the apron is a little bit different because it only goes 5 ml right over here so the bubble is right up here you want to make sure that the bubble is down at the five which it is right now so you're gonna just go make sure the bubble is up here like here okay and you're gonna go slowly 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 and then you're gonna wait a little bit and then go again up onto the two and stop right there unravel all the medication has been administered through the pipeline so time to cap it i'm going to use the swab cap so just remove it there is alcohol already in the cap right now so i'm just going to unravel this and i'm just going to put this in there push it in like that and then just turn so and that is the cap please note a disclaimer i am not a medical profession so i'm not a medic i'm not a nurse i'm just showing you how we do our treatments at home so please talk to your doctor if you have any questions about this medication or about this process thank you so much for watching and if this is your first time and you enjoy what you see please feel free to subscribe. Thank you so much and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.